And, and Juliet's not dead from that fall for some reason. She's human after all. That really should have killed her. But I suppose Nick's decapitated head is still alive, so I probably shouldn't be too surprised about that. Although it is not stated anywhere that Julia is especially hardy in the way Buffy the Vampire Slayer would have been. Anyway, our first boss. That's that's quite the that's quite the stage you've got there, uh, Zed. It's good to know. Where's your band? Is he lip syncing? All right, boss man. So we appear to have found ourselves in the junkyard. So I don't know if you can tell, it'll be more apparent when the boss fight starts, but... Yeah, he's firing letters at us, basically. The words he says are coming out as actual attacks. Which is kind of clever, actually. The things he chooses to say about us are, are not so great. Oh no, Superman 3! Alright, so we're just saying no to physics today, I guess. Okay, whatever. She's a zombie hunting cheerleader with a, you know, bedazzle chainsaw. I really shouldn't be so surprised. Oh, oh. Get out of here. I, I don't. I really don't. I suppose Juliet would be a cheerleader now. She probably loves it. One thing I've noticed playing uh, playing other similar kind of brawler games like Dove May Cry or God of War or Bayonetta or something like that, uh, it's when characters get locked into their combo and you can't get out of it. I really don't like it. I really hate that. And it happens a lot in this, basically. But you're kind of forced to pick combos that you can cancel out of quickly. Because there's... There's never a waste of a Volvo. No one should be buying Volvos. Uh, okay, uh, what, the, what the hell happened there? So you've got like, let's say Dove May Cry. Uh, you, can, you can cancel out of pretty much every attack. You know, he doesn't really get locked in his combos. Uh, God of War, he does kind of a little bit. Kratos. It's not great, but you can always dodge. Which, which, is, which is always good. But you can definitely get locked into your combo in this. That's kind of annoying. Anyway, nice. Fuck! What a douchebag! Quit destroying shit for no reason. But but he's in a video game. He has to destroy shit. And they definitely don't need a reason. Uh, prompt. This guy has some serious women issues. See, I'm stuck. Like, I didn't mean to do that, but I'm stuck in that combo. I can't get out of it. It's annoying. I'll stop talking about it now. Unless it gets me killed. Which it might. Screw you, Hizzix! She's kinda hot anyway, Nick. Especially when she kicks ass. Now, last minute health item. Because it's boss fight time. Let's get Juliet to this incredible amount of flips. How the hell did you get up there? So, Zed is uh, voiced by uh, Jimmy Urin, who I had not heard of before the game. Uh, and he also collaborates on the music choices for the game. Which are pretty good choices. It's so. not the morning, Zed. A bit of a dick, really. Have you played Kingdom Hearts and had to do the fucking... Oh, what's the ship thing called? The gummy ship sections? 
I think Chip and Dale deserve some death for that. Alright, Zed's the first boss, and there's not a whole lot to him, really. Just dodge, and come back in, and attack, and then dodge again. You know, like every boss ever. And that's the end of him. That shit's it. You are rocking. Lol, no, that's not the end of him. Of course it's not. Oh, I did not need to know that. Can zombies jizz? I guess, since he did. Of course not. There is plenty of other. There's plenty left in this boss fight. Oh, nailed! Alright, don't let him stay on the thing, basically. Uh, higher difficulty levels, uh, there's more than one of those spinning discs. Otherwise, not much to him. Uh, the roadies are going to be really pissed at me. I'm killing, breaking all their speakers. Stop moving, Zed. He's running out of them now. And that's the end. Oh, that's a big one. You got it, Zed. Oh, I'm way ahead of you, Nick. Way ahead of you. Stupid, stupid what? I don't think you're allowed to say that, Zed. Huh? I'm already on stage. Uh, shouldn't the speaker be broken, like, right now? What? You cannot attack me with the word cocksucker, Zed. What are you doing? You're the weirdest boss. I like this actually that you uh, you use your chainsaw to uh, like highlight when there's been a change in the boss fight. I quite like that. That's that's really nice. As opposed to the game just you know randomly switching to a new level. It's nice. It's oh shit. It's a nice um, feature. Take that, Zed. There's a trophy for that if you do that enough times. Oh shit, editor. Run for you, Zed. Get back here. Fucking giant letter bullshit. All right, it's gotta be. It's the third time. It's gotta be it. It's right in his head too. And it is. It is Zed. I think it's pretty cool, actually, Zed. Get your hands off and your face oh, and bifurcated. Really hurts, oh! Did she cut him down the exact same cut again? Either she threw that really far in the air, or this fight was really quick. Uh, I'm assuming Latin, and I think it says, uh, My life, king, for your nefarious plans. You did it! I think that's what it says. How'd you get here? We're like miles away from the courtyard. Yes. He's totally dead. Look at this. Where'd you get this? What, what am I looking at? Looking at an extremely elaborate map. This is a bit much. Is this your own map? Of course he was. Of course he was. But the other four are here. Rotting the school. What? The school has a cathedral and a farm and a full chi fun something center. The school is probably filled with the school has a junkyard too, for some reason. Sensei! Mr. Morikawa. Sensei Morikawa. <laughs> Nick is not in this conversation. What's up? humans must die. That's a bit, that's a bit harsh. Oh, okay. He's being, like, philosophical and shit. 
No. Oh, he's not dead yet. For you, Juliet. <laughs> no. Happy birthday, Juliet. Nice. You were always my favorite pupil. Sensei! And now he's really dead. Maybe. Looks like it. How did she embed a chainsaw into the ground? It's not like it has like sharpness. You have to turn it on and like grind it into the ground and then stop it. I don't know. No stairway to heaven? Heaven is a uh, handicap adjacent, I guess. That is totally a JPEG. Alright, what do we get? Open up a present. You don't have to wait till you get home. Okay, we got exhausts on our chainsaw. Maybe it's super powered. And we'll find out what that is in the next level, I guess.